This is a big challenge. I want you to think about this, what I'm going to demonstrate without any uh, pre-ideas. I know when I go different places, seven or eight out of ten club players are doing this action. Set, drop it, turn it, pronate hit. So it goes there and there. From the back, it goes there and then it comes out that way. Why? Players are doing it in order to make the pronation. There and then pronation to get the power. What I want you to try is try to make kind of a wave hitting action. For example, what I am against, what I am arguing with this skill is this. Once it goes down here, whatever I did here will not add power that way. Instead, it will cause problem. So this action is doing nothing. Instead, taking more time, changing the directions. It feels like hitting the opponent, not that way, hitting the opponent like that, come out and change it. So set that way and the on the way, change direction. So whatever I do here, nothing to do with this way of hitting. So this is the one I want you to try. So you set, set, shuttle is coming. Elbow is back, elbow goes up, same time rocket goes backwards, there. There, and then hit. So it's So it's kind of a kind of wave there. There, elbow goes, elbow goes, rocket back, and then automatically it will go. This is similar to what I explained at the beginning. Set, like that. Once my rocket goes behind like this, I lose balance. I lose direction. And then I have to force it. I have to force only here to there. So actually, this way of swing is from, I can count the length of swing from here to there. So here to there is let's say one meter. But if I count uh, this swing length, Start from here, there, there. Two meters, because uh, it makes wave. Because it start from this action, adds power to the second action. So there, there, there. So there, there, there.
No, I, I'm not talking about this way uh, like that. No. This is, uh, you should not do that way. You lose uh, everything. Set, the hit, clear. The drop shot, the smash. You will be surprised how simple it is, how much more powerful and how much more deceptive that is. Up here. Okay, watch this. I set, I drop, hit. That's pushed. I made several clips about this, but it is so important. I have to point this last one out to you. So this is the down and turning action. One more. There, there. Now, the wave hitting actions. So you said, watch this. It's kind of a, I give uh, effort 60, 70%. And because of this uh, automatic action, generate 20, 30, 40% uh, automatic power at the end. Feel it, please. Here, elbow goes forward, uh, automatically racket goes back, and then flip. Yes, I am using pronation there but only 40, 50%, not 100%. So look, here, from that direction, set, my racket comes this way. There, and then pronate. Because I already changed a bit. So I am not, not doing pronation. I am doing the pronation, but I am doing it less. Why? To get more deceptions, to get more choices. Okay, now the wave hitting action. Set elbow go forward. Set elbow go, hit automatically in front. There, there, there. Compare. There. There, there, there. There. There, there, there. 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 So I am cutting all the back action out. I am making the hitting action more from side of my body, start from here to forward. Start from here to forward. Drop, clear, smash. Please be opened and I want you to try out with a positive mindset. If you don't feel this is right, you don't have to take it. But, but if you don't try out, you never know what you are missing out.